That was the coolest thing you've done since you got here. <laughs> Shut up. Yeah, that was funny. I ain't gonna lie. First things first, let's get one thing straight. Well, we're having fun until you started talking. The elite run this shit. You're not cool. Like, I hope you know that. Kenny Omega handpicked their dream team. And these guys pulled out all the stops. They even set me on fire. Yet you're here completely unscathed. No scars or nothing. Great continuity. Good job. For my first match back here in nine months, I took my piece of the dragon when I pinned one of the greatest wrestlers who's ever lived, Brian Daniels. And who predicted the Elite were going to win? I did. I'm doing this for y'all. I hope y'all know that. I'm watching this for you. Because I care about y'all. I care about the E Squad. You guys are great. You're awesome. Whatever you say, Nicholas. Kazuchko Kata, but take a look. We got you something. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I hope Darby's in that car and he crashes it. What's up with the screen? Why are y'all enabling this? Come on, y'all. Oh my god, this is so lame. Why? Wow, he just goes back to normal face. Like, he can't even. For Come on. I can't stand these people. It was a barbed wire steel cage match. Right before the cage match, I was sitting there at the go, and I wished Adam good luck, and I said, break a leg. But Adam, we're praying for you. We're thinking about you. I know you're going to come back stronger. I'm sorry, man. That just sucks. So sincere. However, as EVPs, we have to make... The tough decisions. Oh, God. So, Adam Copeland, tonight, you are hereby stripped of the TNT title. They're like, come on, he's injured. Like, duh. The network is all on our case, and they're saying we need a new champion. And, well, we know just the guy. If you say Jack Perry. After the biggest pinfall victory of his entire career in anarchy in the arena, ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the new TNT champion, the scapegoat, Jack Perry. Just a minute. Just a minute. Who is that? The last time we spoke, you were talking about some sort of severance package for me, but I wanted to let you know that I don't need that package anymore because I've got a brand new job. Wait, what? Tony Khan has named me the interim executive vice president, which means when I make an announcement, it's coming directly from Tony Khan himself. He's gonna just make you like the guy? Like, 
friend Young man, don't you disrespect me. You call me my like God given name of Christopher. Oh, finally, some. As far as this championship goes, we're not giving this away because this is AEW where the best wrestle. Jack Perry, if you want to be a champion in this company, you got to earn it. But you'll get an opportunity to do just that. Because the next few weeks, we're going to have a tournament. Matches. Oh. Matches with no seconds or managers at ringside, no outside interference. The winners of those matches will go on to Forbidden Door to wrestle for the vacant TNT Championship in a ladder match. Oh, oh wow. And the first okay. match is going to happen. On Friday Night Dynamite, in the best town I've ever been in, right here, Los Angeles, California. Friday Night Dynamite. No, 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 no. Hey, no, we're happy that you're back, Stevie. You know what? Let's go tell him how happy we are that he's back here at AEW. The acclaim. Yo, listen, I'm about the freestyle, yo, yo, Okada, you're whack, you got blonde hair, and we know that you don't really care, <laughs> let me shut up, bro, I'm joking, I can't, I can't freestyle, that's so stupid, there's bars right there, boy, y'all know about it, y'all know about it, Elite. That's funny as heck. I tried to freestyle. Ah, uh, one day I'll do it right. One day. Woo! 